And greetings, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to episode 41 of my journey through Group Self-Found Necropolis League. Last time, I spent the entire day in lab only getting a single non-transfigured to transfigured gym transfigure, which would give me a 50-50 chance for Lightning Spire Trap. I had four of these leveled, and since then, I have run seven more labs. This is the last one that I have, and that includes my div cards giving them to me as well so far i got one non-transfigured to transfigured it gave me lightning spire trap of overloading and then i kept feeding that through the rng one and eventually got a single lightning spire trap of zapping so i have one and i have one last one i got a be twice blessed as well so the only thing i can do try and transfigure this it's not giving me what i want no okay so i can keep the gym try it again no okay and then another just rng roll on it negative so i get one chance to double corrupt lightning spire trap of zapping it'll be like the seventh one i'll have double corrupted with no 21 should it fail and hopefully i can get that and then afterwards go in hard into t17 maps that's what i wanted to do last time whether i get the gym corrupt or not that's what we are doing today so i need to quality this up these extra lightning spire traps hold on to them when i get more trips into lab i guess this has a dorianis institute apex of ascension this one has a double corrupt as well. This has Toxic Grove. Also an Apex of Ascension. I don't have any more vials though. Let's see, where is it at? Right here. And the two rooms I need to hit are at the top. Good. Lapidary Lens, please be nice to me. 2011. Nope. No uniques from the chests. And then let's delete this thing real quick. Yep goes up and goes back down so regardless of not getting the gym i move the gym into a red socket so it's not getting the bonus chance for them to trigger anymore and i am borrowing a level for empower so i've gained three gym levels since the last time i did these oh so it, there's just a random chance that that happens you get a double corrupted string of servitude life and discipline or effect is not the greatest combo but i guess that's just a random drop chance okay so i have five of these corrupted in here i have the one that i'm using that's corrupted and i know i converted one into xp for one of these empowers so that is at least seven that i've double corrupted and not gotten a single 21 all right I also have a bunch of fortress maps already rolled. Grasping vines on hit. I want to know if I can just throw this in here without any of the extra stuff I need to craft on. Heist. I need T17 tree. No extra shrines, but all the stuff's in there. And see if I can get to the boss with these monsters in here. So then I can get through them quicker without having to use embers to replace enemies and optimize that. I have even more damage than I did last time. I just need to make it to the boss. And here is my haste aura, I think. Yes. And a blueprint. Okay, and then, yeah, there's going to be barrels. Ooh, that was a boss, like, like the dry lake boss thing. But as an actual enemy, we got some multi-proj going on. All right, just, like, dash past it. Oh, that looks scary. Okay, put a checkpoint. Portal. There is a soul fight. A little bit of extra damage. Ow, those barrels hurt. Okay, and then... Don't get hit. Don't get hit. Don't get hit. Don't get hit. Ah, almost had him. Oh, and we're spinning now. Uh, well, I guess maybe I shouldn't have ran in the middle. Throw traps. Don't get hit by that. Oh, he has extra AoE compared to normal. Okay, that's not something I was thinking about. There, boss dead. Reach a total increased quant from completed maps. Challenge complete. Awakening, cosmic fragment, and I dip. Because I didn't put my embers in, I don't care if I don't clear the rest of that map. And there we go. And then 
doing this, I can farm up fragments for bosses. Runes of Searing Exarch in here. Right here is Hawk. And I can get another chest. Now, ooh, give me shrine. Give me shrine. Oh, and echoing. Okay. Well, if I make it to the boss, it's going to die real quick this time. We're down a checkpoint portal. There's a map back there. Maps I can farm elsewhere. Scarabs I can farm elsewhere. Corpses I can farm elsewhere. The only reason for running these maps is this boss. Move. That was the, like, punchy bit. Okay. Boss step. Awakening and decaying. Then I'm out. Vulnerability, fizzes, fire. Frenzy charges. Got a shrine with speed. Let's go. Got Huck. Just run. In this situation, like, it's giving me exactly what I want. It's like, quick. Quick. Farm Ubers. Mm. Okay, he's spinning. Yeah. Decaying and cosmic fragments. Drox map, awakening, cosmic. I have another Sirius I can try. I don't think I'm touching them at least till I finish the already rolled fortress maps. And then I'll probably take a crack at those Ubers before trying the others, the other T17s. Elevated expanses, complete maps with at least 50 pack size complete. 25 challenges done. Oop, and a decaying fragment. Okay, less defenses map means I do not get my zealotry because it lowers my energy shield. Okay, I have learned. Died five times in this map, managed the boss, killed it. <laughs> Decaying, devouring, augmented distant memory. This map was pretty nuts. 214 fizzes extra random element with 59% less defense. And temp chains. Awakened added lightning damage leveled up. So that's an extra level on my orb of storms. Ooh, exalted orb. I will go back for that. Another one down, devouring fragment. Out of portal scrolls. Oh, that's not good. Ah, finally. Portals did drop in this map. Blueprint fully revealed. This one's got life as energy shield. Ah, this one has life as energy shield. And it seems like he just goes through the same punch attacks and doesn't do any of his other stuff. So, like, he won't do his spin attack, I don't think, until he's reached a HP threshold or something. And it also makes him scary. Because if he hits me, I die. Ah, okay. There's the balls. Ah! Uh... No! I'm somehow alive! And now we're doing the spinny bit. So this is where it all ends! Yep, okay. I need to get back in there before his life comes back. Oh no, I missed it. Eee! Move. No, dead. Okay, first one I failed. I, I should have looked at the mods again on that, but the big thing there was the life as energy shield did not go well. So I failed one. Veritania, Eradicator, Awakening Fragment. Hmm, got blown up by the barrels. Morgue's almost full. Oh, just go! But the shrines get me killed the, more than they're useful. Reality and Decaying Fragments. Got a Baron, Eradicator, Aventurous Gamble, Reduced Quant. Otherwise, meh. No, I failed another one. Tormented Boss with extra resistances. Really low cooldown recovery rate on my Frost Blink as well. Ooh, Divine Shrine. Well, okay. I'm okay with that. This is a buff effect map too, so it's not going to last. Okay, well, it's still got 20 on the timer, so we'll see what happens. 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. I need to move, and I need to move. Okay, probably about to start spinning. Ooh, no. And done. Blazing and devouring fragments. Learned that the bloodstained saw blades is bad. Less defenses is bad. 75% less AoE, that's gotta be bad. An LE pin is bad. So I think the rest of these get re-rolled. Cosmic awakening fragment. Petrification statues. Let's see if that goes poorly. <laughs> Ah, click the shrine and die. A very common occurrence. Man, dash into barrels and die. Another common occurrence. I did not see a single petrification statue. Did I miss the boss? Oh, see, I started up here. Hmm, maybe it's, maybe it was still further over here. Yeah, it was up here. 
Okay, oh, this one was super easy. Decaying and cosmic fragments. Another really easy one though, once I made it. Cosmic fragment. These things that shoot the like ball lightnings do way, way, way too much damage. Those do way too much damage. So after making it through those, I've got two uber, uber elders. An uber exarch, uber shaper, and uber cirrus. Just chaos spam these until they light up and then look back through them. See what's doable. Reduced auras, double physics extra, less AoE, impale, okay. Minus max, Ellie pin, that one is fine. Ellie pin, less defense, steel charges, damage with physics extra, maybe. Barrels, possibly. Steel charges, minus max, Ellie reflect. This is extra petrification statues. That one should be doable. Less defenses. No spell suppression. This one should be doable. Possessed boss in feeble speed. Life is yes. No. Damage with this is extra vulnerability. That seems super scary, but maybe. Helipid. Speed, Fizz's extra, less AoE, and Frenzy Charges, no thank you. Barrels, less defense. So like, even when they show up that they might be good, it's still just like, maybe 50-50 that it's runnable. Petrification Statues, no, Charge Steel, I'm not running that. Monster Damage with Fizz's extra, that's very bad. Speed, Life is yes, okay. Ellie Reflect, Reduce Suppression, Fizz's extra with AoE, Multi Proj, nope. Spell Suppression, Petrification, that one's doable. Less Recovery Rate, less Defenses. Steel Charges, Fizz Reflect, less Recovery Rate. Steel Charges, 90% Reduced Auras, Fizz Reflect, no Regen. Life Resistance, Buff Expire Faster, Temp Chains, I'm gonna have to do that one. Life, Ellie Res, okay. Getting further, Petrification Statues and Feeble. That's a nice one. Steel Charges, less defense, minus max, Fizz Reflect, Charge Steel. Life Spell Suppression with Big Fizz's Extra and Vulnerability. Ooh, I don't know. Maybe. I got what might be worth trying at least. Minus Max. No region. No region. Minus Max. Belly Reflect. Reduced Action Speed. Recovery Rate. Minus Max. Okay, this one is Boss Damage with Fizz's Extra. Maybe. Minus max, shaper touch, that's the only thing really bad there. Minus max, only two left. No suppression, spell suppression, auras, Ellie pin, less recovery rate. Grasping vines, petrification statues, that one's fine. Monster life, okay, 19 more. <laughs> awakening and awakening. First time I've seen two of the same fragment come from one. I got petrified and I survived it. Whoa. Yay, enemies in the boss room. Awakening cosmic fragments. All right, consecrated ground did not show up at all in the boss room. That's good. That's a very good thing. Decaying and decaying. That's right. I got it. And I'm not dead. Yay. Devouring cosmic fragments. Eradicator. Decaying and cosmic fragments. I have not gotten the amulet. Yay. Oh, it's going to wear off fast again on me the divine shrine but i can guarantee the brittle and everything on this boss that has life and ellie res at least for a second here oh it looks like it has extra aoe too mm. holy strike i got it with the frost blink two more awakenings hydra two more awakenings alter distant memory speed physics fire yeah this one's been rough not made it far in this map fireball goatman is also a bit of an issue ah yeah everything just like destroys me in this map Rip. i feel like i gotta try the physics extra ones though like it's so costly to re-roll them yay speed shrine go you get the speed shrine i have enough speed to like get past all of their attacks unless they uh get get one off of course <laughs> i didn't see any soul fight that way so i go the other way oh this boss looks tormented with physics extra this is kind of like hold on for dear life means the spinny beam is gonna hurt really bad too uh oh it's a terrible spot to start it going backwards go should stop yep okay 
Cool. Back in it. Move. Move. Huck is taking damage. Can Huck die? Two devouring fragments. Cool and eater. Devouring fragment. Drox map. Reality fragment. The additional barrels is brutal. Ah, so many times. I, I just dash into barrels and dead. All right, made it to the boss. One portal this time. 118% life. Let's go. Hit the flasks. Hit the brittle. Dodge. Dodge. Oh, this is going to be rough. Ah. Ooh. Spin incoming. Yep. Okay. Cross that one. Cross that one. He should be stopping. Yep. Ah. Ooh. Come on, buddy. Ooh. He targeted Huck. Oh, we're spinning again. Almost there. Okay, gotta move. Dash. Should be good. Almost there. Ah, yeah, I forgot calling strike on the frost blink. I could have finished that earlier. Oh, spend five lives getting the boss, then kill the boss. Blazing fragment. Chimera. I'm out of portal scrolls. Uh oh. Make a bunch of wisdom scrolls. Purchase a bunch of portal scrolls. Reality awakening. Phoenix. That amulet drop is ridiculously rare. It would seem. The twins. Fully revealed blueprint. Decaying fragment. Extra barrels. Mm. Hey, try to click shrine and die. <laughs> Almost like I shouldn't even worry about the shrines. Oh, blinking barrels. What do you know? Oh, that was a lot of barrels. <laughs> oh, that's a harvest scarab of doubling. Worth more. Ah, no, the boss is back here. Okay, this is my last portal, so hopefully. Uh-oh. Now, no. Business extra with resistances. Frenzy charges. <sighs> I did get a Harvest Scarab of doubling out of there, though. Okay, this thing. Lightning Protectors. I know. I, I definitely know that, that is bad news. Because those things just do too much damage. So, replace that. I It's like I walked up and clicked. I clicked down here to move. And I walked up and touched the barrel and blew up. Mm, barrels. Ah, four additional projectiles. Suits. I really dislike these maps. The enemies are overtuned. The, the mods are overtuned. The bosses are cool. But my goodness. These maps were pretty much made to not be enjoyable. What it feels like. Yeah. Dead to barrels. Oh, I didn't replace the nasty ball lightning. I got petrified. And while petrified, I can still put down a portal. <laughs> nice. Cool. And then I can go do the boss. Ooh, extra AoE. Gotta remember. Oh, you got speed to finish it. There we go. Decaying fragment. Oh, I clicked the shrine, but then died. Same thing, different map. I got petrified by an army of chimerals. Sometimes these bosses just melt. Especially when I get the bottled faith off and I can run through it, get the brittle ground. Boss dies. Decaying awakening. Last one of these maps. Oh, that's a blueprint. Oh, move. That's how these go. Try and find some soul fights. Try and get the rogue markers. About halfway down, I'll drop a portal. Keep moving. Oh, there were some barrels. Oh, hey, a shrine that didn't kill me. Yo, hey, hey, that is more soul fight. I should be getting pretty close. Is this it? It is. Put the portal down in here. Drop down over storms. The curse. Get my aura. Run across move oh that's a drowning orb mm. 
More curse. Another one of these. More drowning orbs. This is a tanky boss. Ooh, Grace saved me there. Now we're doing spinning circles. Oh, oh. Drowning orbs. Why is this thing in here? Got to dash across that. Across that. And then it should be stopping. Good. More aura, more curse, and move. This is one of the tankier ones that I've had to deal with. Ah. Move. Spinning in circles again. And blink into it. There we go. Dead. Decaying fragments. And I leave. Boom. Just like that. No more fortress maps. I got a lot of citadels, abominations, some sanctuaries, and ziggurats. Fragments. I have an eater, three uber uber elders, one maven, one exarch, one shaper, three cirrus. Do I just jump into them or go next? I don't want to just go next map while I'm in the brain of just like rush boss, kill boss. Boss damage, speed, AoE, maybe. Spell suppression, less AoE. I don't know how this boss fight's going to go on this character. Less AoE. Giving Katarina multi -proj is very bad news. It's not do physics extra. Life is ES is probably okay. Yeah, that one's good. Less recovery rate. Monster damage, life is ES. Okay. Monster damage, AoE, multi -proj. This is extra, just AoE? The AoE on Katarina is so bad though. Boss damage, speed, synthesis boss? Otherwise, that one's fairly free. Okay. Monster life, Maven. That one's fine. Minus max. Buffs expire faster. Life is ES, okay. Volatile core, so that's less recovery rate. 81% physics chaos? That's ridiculous. This one seems fine, except for the physics chaos. Maybe it's doable. Boss life, AoE. Otherwise, good. One left. Boss damage, cast speed with curses. Okay, got 11 of these ones rolled. This one looks easily the most doable. Oh, well, it's got a synthesis boss. That could be bad. Try and do an easy one first, just to make sure I can do it. There's no explodey barrels in this one. That's pretty nice. A little bit more room to maneuver as well. I made it to the boss. Hey, okay, let's go, Katarina. Out. Ooh, big A we. We faced. We're faced. Ooh, move. All right, made it through that. Nope. No, we're, we're rising children. No. Feed. Ooh. That that has to be Fizz Degen. There's no reason that should have hurt that much. Ah. Okay. Three portals left. Oh. No. The extra explodies. Oh, and we're making more of them, eh? Ah, last portal. Hmm, there's a lot of chaos damage there. I should have looked at the mods too. Okay, I had a lot of good damage off the start and then just like dead, 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 dead. So let's take stabilities in on this. This one has Tim Chain's monster damage, boss damage, boss speed though. Let me go with this one. This is synthesis boss Tim Chain's. No extra damage on the boss. All right, made it to the boss. No issues getting to the boss. And synthesis boss in here already phased. Synthesis boss moved. And the synthesis boss is a cortex. And I wound up dying to the Kurgle beam. Hey, Kurgle dead. Target Katarina. I think I got the cortex. Saved a portal. Okay, phased. No minions. Oh, come on. I didn't even move. 
either. I did what I was supposed to. Okay, so I still need to dodge it. The problem is Ulamon's chaos damage. That's bad. Ah. Ow. Kurgle, die! Okay, Kurgle's dead. No! Okay, but I phased, so that means the degen here goes away. Remove as many of them as I can. One there. Ow! Blink! Amanamu! I died. Okay. Still four portals. Move. Okay. Evade it. That works too. So just Katarina. Die. Okay, good. Devouring, synthesizing, Hydra. No helmet. And that was with like nothing on it. So like the big problems I was having with that was chaos damage actually from Ulamon. And I have 55 chaos res and I don't think I have. Yeah, I only have one prismatic catalyst. I could definitely push my chaos res up with catalysts, but not the easiest thing to do. So I think I hold off on the rest of the ziggurats. This one looks pretty doable. Let's try a sanctuary map. No stability. I think this boss is way easier. Petrification statues. You know, let's go with stability just to make sure. Plenty of room to move in this map as well. No barrels. Just a matter of find the boss. Hey, the twins. I want that. Oh no, I'm petrified. Drop portal. Ha ha. Let me out. Hey, I survived. Oh, portal outside the boss. Go in. I've got shrines. <laughs> and I have flasks. And Lysia is already faced. Come on, beat that. Where you at? I thought we was faced. Like, what? There we go. There's the beat at. Ooh, 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 ooh. Ooh, ow, ow. Oh, halfway on BDAT. Oh, still taking damage from the traps. So Lycia can not always be in the center of the room. So the things are coming out from where she's located. Huh. Oh, another petrification statue in here. He that dead. Ow! Alright. Let's go. Uh, there we go. Awakening and Blazing Fragments. Do these bosses show up in the ritual? Let's find out. No. I don't think I'm using stabilities on these. Uh, actually, let me double check what mods were on this. Frenzy charges. I had less AoE. So no boss life or damage. Not as easy as it can get, actually. Well, I died twice in there without any boss damage or anything. So I have to imagine that I just need to learn to avoid those dangerous attacks. Because when they start getting boss damage and speed and stuff, we're almost all 50,000 milliseconds latency. Anyways, what I was saying, I don't know if the boss damage is going to matter. Because I'm going to get destroyed by those attacks anyways. Oh, I didn't get kicked out of the game. I stayed in the game through all that. Imagine. I'm thinking this one, less AOE with extra damage of a random element. Whenever I got hit, I died anyways. So maybe. This is chaos. I'm not feeling good about though. Synthesis boss, consecrated ground, Ellie res. I think I could handle that. Even though there's volatile cores. Boss life with life is ES. Oh, that's less defenses. No barrels. No, thank you. 
All right, I got a bunch of these rolled. Hopefully they're doable. Got to put them in and try. Divine orb. Oh, dead. Some corpse explosions. Ah, finally found the boss. Oh, oh, that's lovely, Maven. That beam hurts so bad. Maybe it's chaos damage. Is that the last portal? Might have been the last portal. That was the AoE extra projectiles. With spell suppression. Yep. Yeah. Rip. This one looks a bit easier. Okay, there's a Maven and Shaper. I really don't want to use these stability things, but go for it. Oh, lightning protectors. Get them out. All right, made it to boss. I did not die to that. Okay, phased. I can't, I can't see those ground things. Not a chance. Well, I can't run with them either. Ah, I got sniped by B-Dead. Oh, come on. Okay. Back to Lycia. Okay, dodge that. Okay, dead. Awakening, devouring. That was just some monster life. So what about some fizzes extra? Made it to the boss, deathless with shrines. And dodge the beam. Dodge big blast. I didn't dodge second big blast. Ow. Hmm, that pulse from BDAT hurts so bad. Die, BDAT. Ah! Okay, where's your beam? Ah! Okay, there was the beam. Last portal. Whoa! What even hit me? Okay. Still got the portal. Okay, so those fly back out and being hit by the spear thing. Okay. Ow! So that fizz is extra. Probably not the play. Okay. That was the big Fizz's Extra of a random. Yeah, that was the only one with a big Fizz's Extra, except for this one that has a Fizz's Cold. <laughs> Made it to boss. Again. And dodged beam. And faced. And died to the first, like, outward pulse of those. Ooh. Dodge that. Dodge that. And he's dead. Okay. Oh, you just got some speed. Oh, dead. <laughs> that was with Monster Life. Devouring Fragment, Reality Fragment, Barren Map. This one has some monster damage. Another easy instant phase on Lycia. Oh, be that. Come leaping at me. I got him halfway, though. Not this one. Now. Okay. Oh! Okay, it doesn't phase instantly. Sure, fine, I guess. No, 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 no. Ah. Wow, I took a step and instant did. No. Getting there. No, the beam. Still three portals. She dead? Yep. Synthesizing fragment. This one is the other fizz is cold. Instant phase. Lycia. Ah. Oh, the snipe. I, I was dodging the floor things. So was not paying attention to beat it. Just how this goes. Ow. Still good. Oh, arrow? Arrow? No. And then I walk into that. No, 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 no. Dump beam. Oh, die, please. Coal. Coal. Devouring and blazing. And none of the rest of these have extra 
damage in the boss fight. Okay, I'm gonna remove the stabilities. I got shrines. Please don't kill me. That's their beam. But you're faced. Alright, I know BDAT spawns right here. Ah! Die, please! Okay, BDAT dead, BDAT dead. These keep coming. Ha! Ah! Ah, beam. Dead. Devouring fragment. And I need to empty my morgue. Go again. Oh, I didn't get out of it quick enough. Almost phased. Be that die, please. Okay. Ah, dead. Synthesizing fragment. This map is so much easier to path through and just like get to the boss than that fortress map. That fortress map was always terrible to get to the boss without fail exalted orb this map's also pretty linear so getting all the soul fights really easy i get to see pretty much all of my smugglers caches who awakeners desolation all over the boss room okay move oh they're still coming this way Got it. Move. Almost. One more. Got it. Synthesizing and blazing. One portal left on this one. Died three times getting here. Boss damage speed rip. Ooh, synthesis boss. Hello. Oh, he's putting degen puddles on the ground. Typical synthesis boss behavior. Ah, did I get rewritten? I, no, the degen puddles are still there. I got the rewritten. Ah, oh, oh, she's on consecrated ground too. No. No. It's like, feels like the longer this fight goes on, the worse it gets with the spear things. Oh, okay. Well, that's all of those. Down to 61 maps. Abominations I already have the unique from. So maybe I go for that next. And then use the rest of the stabilities trying to beat the Citadel boss. Pulling up Abomination maps now. I don't know how these are going to go. I think I need like a second regex to like paste in here once it's like removed some of the bad stuff. I feel like AoE multiproj is really bad in this fight. I think I'm just going to try the ones that I made and see how this one goes. So that was an easy one. Well, I don't know about easy because it's volatile cores and a synthesis boss, but we'll see what happens. This map is also really narrow. Whoa, 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 whoa. Yeah, this one's going to be rough. So probably want to really avoid barrels in this map. And if I don't kill any rares on my way to the boss, then I won't die to the volatile cores. Hopefully I can find the boss. Oh, and I found the boss. Okay, so how do I want to do this? Who do I want to focus first? I I feel like Dodre is the worst. Uh Oh, Dodre. Oh my god. Okay, I got one. Ah. Uh, okay, so killing uh, Malagaro just puts the blade vortex. Ah. Uh, okay. Well, just Dodre's left. Okay, and there goes Dodre. Ow. AoE is ridiculous. Oh no, I got an effluent on me. The challenge is kill this boss without getting an effluent. And I got 
I didn't get any because I killed Dodre last, but then there's the ground stuff. Synthesizing fragment. Yeah, that wasn't too bad. And that was some life is ES. Yeah, you increase the AoE in there. That's bad news. Multi-proj is very bad news for Chevron. Like, straight up, these bosses were not designed for these map mods. Like, it, it's just a yikes, man. This one also has life as ES, endurance charges with some extra life, reduced effect to curses. Unique bosses are possessed. That sounds bad. Boss damage attack cast speed seems kind of bad. With spell suppression, reduced effect of curses. This one has barrels and spell suppression. This one has some boss life AoE, boss damage... Boss life AOE. Uh, uh. Oh, the only reason I'm even running these maps is because it is the only way to get certain uniques. It's not because this is enjoyable. All right, so I think the the absolute play is Malagaro first. Oh, you want to stay in the middle on Dodre. I just nuked Dodre so hard. Ah. Uh. Do they heal when the others die? Because Dodre was dead, and Dodre's like full HP now. Where? Chavron, please. Ah! Okay, Chavron, Chavron, okay. And then, yeah, they, they refresh HP. Yo! Ah! Ooh, doo -doo 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 -doo. Still alive, still alive. Oh god. Okay, there's the puddle. Another puddle? No. Oh, I didn't. I didn't get an effluent. Ah, I'm dead. Okay, there was a puddle. Ow. There was a red puddle. Another puddle. Another puddle. Maybe? Nope, there it was. Oh, I got hit with it, though. I died to the hit. I don't know that I, I stepped on a puddle. No. No. I also think I dodged the effluence. No, it didn't give it to me. Synthesizing and reality fragments. And that was a lot of life as ES. With some extra life, reduced effect of curses. Hurt me quite a bit. Let's try the spell suppression. Damage attack cast speed, reduced effect of curses. Okay, they got speed and damage. Oh, that's some speed, all right. Awesome. Oh, I killed Dodre first. So that means... Okay, those are just Dodre's torment. That's not an effluent from the Trinity. But I need to remove those curses. Oh, struggle boss. <laughs> okay, I got the vulnerability one. I need this enfeeble one to go. Ow! Why are you so ugly? Okay, I got Malagaro. This fight is wild. Wow, just instantly dead. Mm, the extra damage on the chaos from the blades is bad. I might fail this one just because the boss gets any mods whatsoever. I got rid of the enfeeble one. Okay. 
Ow. No, 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 no. I have my damage back. Oh, I'm dead, though. Okay, yeah, killing Dodri first. That's rough. This one is just spell suppression in barrels. No extra damage or speed. A we Hey, with the barrels, made it to the boss. Nuke Maligaro. Good. Then right into... Oh, die to Dodre. Oh, it looks like Dodre is dead. Yeah, that in fact was Dodre. Gotta get rid of the Enfeeble. Ah, sucks. Wow, man. The, the spinny cyclone blade vortex from Maligaro. What even hit me on that? The blade vortexes never move, though. They they just stay in the same spot. What am I being hit by? Oh my god. I think the... Dodre is bugged out. And... Not doing anything. That, that's lovely. What a wonderful boss fight. Yeah, Dodre is not moving. But is probably firing things at me. And I'm dead because there's no way to get to this thing and attack it. Like why do these things, they go away and not spawn in a different spot of the room. They just respawn right in the exact same spot when they go away. It's making deal with the totems just impossible. Okay, that didn't go well. That one should have been fairly simple. So maybe I run these with like an aura bot or something. Let me try the other one. I've never beaten the Citadel boss. Which I might not be able to tank the wall lasers. Which means I'll just die. This one has life is ES. It's the only thing on it. Frenzy charges. And take the stabilities in this one. My first attempt at this one. This map was awful to navigate through as well. Yeah. Dead ends and walls all over the place. Very tight quarters. Oh, I found the boss. Okay. Oh, this boss is tormented. That's good. I got touched by the beam. Well, the boss is faced. This is as far as I made it last time. Then I died to wall lasers. Okay, I can tank a couple. Okay. That's got me feeling kind of okay. Almost got Verona down. Oh, cool. I can put a portal out here. Okay, Verona down. Ow. Ow. Okay, beam. Okay. Ah, uh, okay. So we got, we got another boss? Medrin. Okay. Ow. 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 Okay, Medved's almost dead. Still got five portals. Oh. Ah. Is he going to phase again? I don't know. That might be it. Oh, the hands. Why are they so big? He's almost dead. Did I give them AoE on this? No, no AoE. Ah, I got touched by the little balls. Oh, it's all... Got it. Is that it? Yep. Blazing fragment, synthesizing fragment. I mean, they were tormented and I did that one with frenzy charges. It really wasn't that terrible. Spell suppression probably really helped the wall lasers. 
Enfeeble Power Charge Synthesis Boss. Maybe. Well, there's two more. I'm willing to try. Oh, I see the boss. Let me blink that. There we go. Um, how do I get there? Um, sure. Okay. There's Awakener's Desolation in the boss room. Yay, yay, yay. Don't get beamed. Face, please. Face, please. Okay. Okay, Medvid first this time. Ooh. Actually try and dodge the wall lasers. Okay. Ow. Ow. Hmm. Ow. Ah. No. Move. Come on, Medvid. Please dive. Ah. Wow. Got hit with something. Awakener's Desolation. Okay, I wasn't dodging that. I'm doing no damage to it. Lasers got me. Like, what is going on here? They got speed, vulnerability. Vulnerability is probably the reason. Please get through his ward and let me kill him. You die, please. Okay. Oh, I'm just super dead. Okay. Well, I get five. I guess I'm frozen. Awesome. Hmm. So giving them any kind of extra life is also pretty rough. They do not want to die with their ward. I didn't give them extra life. I just gave them, like... Normal map, Ellie Res. It's not even crazy, Ellie Res. I got a window to deal damage there. Come on, just face. Oh. Nope. No more portals. Well, yikes, man. This one's got Enfeeble Synthesis Boss. Give it a shot. This is the only other one that looked doable. The boss. Have a Diamond Shrine for the time being. Ah, uh, okay. Be fast. And we've got a Twisted. That's good. And Petrification Statue showing up in the boss room. Awesome. Ow. Okay, almost got twisted. They got speed? No? Okay. Synthesis boss is out of here, but then I got petrified. Okay, there's a decent spot to have been petrified, I guess. Verona down. Ah. No, I just stuck there. The wall lasers inflict a debuff on you that slows you really badly. Okay. 
Okay, beam. That I understand. I think the beam also inflicts the debuff. Ah. We phased? Okay. Ah. Medvid down. You gonna come out ever? No escape. That's beam. Ah. Okay, this is a wall of... No, that was... No escape. No escape is beam. Got it. <sighs> Cosmic and decaying. That one's not near as bad as the other one. I got a lot of Ubers. Do I dare try? I really want to do Exarch. Because he's going to stay still. And then maybe I can survive the fight. Because I'll just nuke him really quickly. Let's see then. Get a ruby flask. Duration with cast speed. Okay. Then hoard a crafting bench. Give this one max charges. Okay. Then enkindling orb the wild faith again. Extra effect on that. Put max charges on my life flask. Then yeah, I want to see what happens in here. I've never beaten this fight. Does it roll mods on this? No. Okay. Yes, go. Go. Ah. Okay. I'm gonna wait. I'm gonna wait this out. <laughs> I did a lot of damage real quick there, though. Oh. Come on. Nope. Ah! Okay, hey, I died to start the ball phase again. It's fine. He's almost dead. <laughs> got him. I got the staff. It is the worst roll possible, too. Ah! It makes me happy, though. So, I mean, that's what that's what I put myself through all that trouble for, though. Running all those maps. Just boss rush them so I can get stuff like this. Do it again. Go, 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 go. I need a boo. Okay. Oh, I guess I try and just kill this thing. Nope. The Minotaur killed me. He move. Boom. Oh, he moved. Ah. Oh. Rip. No. Okay. No, the Minotaur killed me. No, 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 no. Okay. Yikes. No, Annihilation is so bad. Where do you go in this arena? What is this? Oh, we're doing that again, eh? Lovely. I'm, where'd he go? Did he circle around the whole room behind me? What was that? Last portal. Lovely. He's going to go into a ball phase now. Yep. Oh, okay. Minotaur killed me. Okay, well. <laughs> sure, man. Sure. Well, I got us a staff. So what about Eater? Opaz Flask. Two charges per use. Cast speed. Opaz Flask. Max charges. You know what? I'm going to do that on my Diamond Flask as well. Not worry about the Quicksilver. Okay, slap these in. No mods on this? No. Okay. Gotta keep moving. Blink. Keep moving. Hey. 
Are you kidding me? Why does it have to be so freaking huge? Ah. Oh. Riding mass. That's the time to attack. Okay. Oh, this is where we die. Oh. Uh, here. Okay. What even hit me? What hit me? Oh, okay, okay, okay. No. Breathing mass. They're coming that way. Okay, run to the other side of the universe. Ah. Oh. Okay, an escape will do. Oh, I touched one of the things for a second. It's okay, I think that takes him out of the phase. Uh-oh, run. Oh, run. Inescapable Doom, yay! Ah! Uh, nope. I, I, I died to the tentacle getting pulled in. Lovely. So close. I pushed the frost blink like four times. <laughs> oh, I should have blinked. I should have blinked. Dang it. Try it again. No, I let him hit me. <laughs> nope, hunger. That means you run. You can't attack during hunger. Oh, that's a hunger. Inescapable do. No. Yep. Where are they? Okay. Now. Gotta delay a little bit. Okay. Oh, I'm so dead. Nope. Not dead. Not yet. That one. This one. This one. Oh, there's still two more! <laughs> and it came out of the ground. Oh, move. 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 Dead. Ah, yes. Ashes of the stars. Whew. Cortex. Do an easier one. Well, that's debatable because this one rolls with mods. Magic monsters. Four additional projectiles. Fizzes lightning. Okay. That's not too bad. Okay. It's it. Four additional projectiles is bad. Perfect fossils, though. It's good. All kinds of stuff dropping in here. All right. I need to rush the boss, though. That is the reason we're... <laughs> 
here. All right, made it to the boss. Okay. Okay, well, that works. It's nice when I have all my charges and stuff up. Oh. Oh, I died to the augmented. Okay. You know what? That's pretty awesome. That's some damage. Move. Oh, I brought Maven into this? Uh-oh. Okay. Uh, you're gonna die before you get that off vortex without being hit by wormhole slam complete I'll wait here just make sure i get to watch this item drop nebulous not a great one at that but i get awakened at lightning damage up to level four vortex again this time we've got speed physics lightning and some ellie res okay that means they're gonna die just as quick as the last time and there's breach splinters in this one all right let's go ow okay ellie res ellie res actually mm, ow okay speed plus ellie res Okay, yikes. Will you just die? Okay. Ah! No! Uh oh, that's bad. Pull. Move. Ah. Okay. Did I did I get it? I actually think I got him. No, I did not. Ah. ah augmented. All right. I might not. I might not win this one. I'm getting so slowed by I don't I don't know what was slowing me. And I'm dead. I'm not sure what killed me there either. Okay. Hmm. Max charges on the sapphire flask. Need to reapply. Eternal flask. Let's do the shapers. No maven. I've done this one before. If shaper stays still and does the beam thing. Shaper will die, but then Shaper does this crazy nonsense. But oh, that's what the Sapphire Flask is for, yo! Okay, yep, just stay right there. Ah, where? What was that? You phase already? He's no longer cursed. Base. There we go. Start with the beam. Yes. Hey. Right into that nonsense. Okay. Blask. Good. Good, good, good. Yes. Hmm. No, the extras got me. No, he moved out of all the traps. Oh, oh, we're doing this. Okay, finish him. Oh, mm. 
Will you phase, please? There we go. All right, dodge the things. Or try. Okay, you're down here. Now move. Okay. You're dead. Gotcha. Helmet. Echoes of creation. All the, like, extra enemies in here is so crazy. Whoa. Well, you can blast for me. Level four. Whoa, whoa. Oh, now that's so mean. <laughs> what a combo. Go, 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 go. Oh, there's ads, though. Let's keep throwing traps. Keep throwing traps. Move! Ah! Die, please. No, 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 no. He's calling, though. He's calling Ridge. Ow, ow, ow. Ow. Where are you at? Get back here. No! Call him. There we go. Another helmet. What next? Let's see what the Uber Uber Elder looks like. I think I'm gonna give the Bottle of Faith the max charges. Yeah, that's four uses of the Bottle of Faith instead of one with extra effect. I have beaten this fight once. The character had more than 77 res though. No move. Oh, what did I do? Get the flask. Okay, Shaper has moved to up here. Now down here. Can we please face already? There we go. Oh, okay. We're made to the first ad phase. So sketchy. Oh, now you're up there, Shaper. Now we're Shaper. Oh my goodness. Okay. He don't want to stay still in this fight. Elder. Okay. Slow nonsense. Good spot for all those. Moved in here. Beam. We should be faced. Okay. It's going okay. All the DGENs are up in the top half. Okay, he's out. He's doing his bullet hell. Oh, it would have been nice. You would just stay there, Mr. Shaper. No. Nope. Okay. Yeah, beam, 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 beam. Good, 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 good. Should be phased. And then through here. 
Okay, good. Get wrecked, Elder. Okay, Elder Slam. Oh, I think I, I blinked through a ball. This is going okay, though. I'm fairly happy with how this is going. No, 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 no. You are way too close, Shaper. There we go. Elder. Face, please, face, please. That's faced. Alright, wait for this to pop. Three portals to do the final bit. Ow, so much degen. Alright, Elder Slam. Okay, well, and then this little bit. And that. Okay, yeah, get all the garbage out of the way right now. Okay, and now I'll come back in. Alright, let's go. Mm. Ah, no, 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 no. I'm gonna die. Yeah. Okay. Can I clutch it out? I hope so. Close. Where's Shaper? This is Elder. There's Shaper. Okay, fine. Sure, I guess. Right. Go again. How my flasks look in. Boost up the Eternal Life flask again. Might as well just do it on the Quicksilver as well. Alright, let's go. Shaper. Eat the damage. No, okay. Back to damage. Where? Top. Elder. Mm. No! I was waiting for the balls to come past so I could blink into the circle and then I got beamed. Rough. Okay, Elder is now down here, which is probably not good because oh it's gonna warp on top of me and then just like oh blast you with the balls like haha -ha. i was looking up in the top right of the screen too just like looking for the next set of balls to come okay shaper is doing his nasty bit okay third one now i can damage shaper who's gonna what move because i threw traps at him yep down here beam blast okay ah no 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 Okay, I can, Elder, no, not yet. So close. The arena is dying. Okay, this is fine. We're in the second ad phase. Two, three explosions. Ow, Mr. Elder. That hurt. Ah, I think he's in the bottom left. Yeah, it's okay. He's doing his bullet hell. I'm out of life flask, I think. Ah, where? Shaper. Here. Now bottom left. Slam. Still down there. Still on Shaper. Come on. Okay. Elder time. Ah, oh, I let myself get beamed. Two portals. Oh. Wow. Okay. I got one shot by a single Elder projectile. That is ridiculous. No, 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 no. Okay. Try again. Okay. Shaper phase. Ah. Okay. Fine. Phase. Face. Good, 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 no, 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 oh, Shaper is in a different spot every single time you blink. See, now he's at the entrance, and now he's over there. Oh, no, no, he's up here now. Well, now where? Oh, we're doing the bullet hell. That's fine. I don't mind this. Like, I, I get it. It's an attack. Move. Down, bottom left. Slam. But then he's got a warp. Now we're down here. Oh, now we're top left. Oh, now we're moving again. Back to the bottom right. Oh, the, at least the traps are still going down there. Okay, Elder. No, I got stunned. I got stunned. They were phased. Nope. <laughs> There's three pulses of that. I have no life flasks. Okay, Shaper's doing bullet hell. Oh, I had no life flasks left anyways. Looking rough yet again. Phased. Oh, no. Nope. Okay, I saw that one. Oh, middle, slam, dodged. Okay, slaps. Elder phase, please. Will you phase, please? Oh, I think the elder slam. Oh, God. Okay, elder is basically dead. Got one portal. I need to remove Shaper and we Gucci. All right, good. You're going to be right here, and then you're going to be up here, and you're going to beam. Gotcha. Slam. All right, I got to move here. No! Ah! 
I need more charges on my flask. Get five uses of the sapphire. Yeah, the others are still fine. Last attempt. I got... What did I get stuck on? That's some... Was it Zena? Did I get stuck on Zena? That's some... Mm -hmm. Great way to start the fight. Let me tell you. Based. Uh, yep, I got stuck. It wouldn't let me blink. All right, Shaper is damageable. Oh, bullet hell. Then he's top left. And then he's going to move again. Bottom. Uh-oh. Well, that was a thing that happened. Get that one off. There we go. Switch into Elder. No, no, no. Yeah, there's not room there. No. No, I died to a Dejan puddle on the ground. God, I'm I was really determined to get one of these, but, you know, what can you do? Fight's hard. I am pretty happy about the fact, though, that I don't have to waste my normal Uber Elders. Like, I'd give up the chance for a Watcher's Eyes just to attempt this, and it always felt bad. You would never even attempt Uber Elders. Uber Uber in SSF. There's no way I'm finishing this one, probably. I'm I'm gonna die to some BS. Like an Elder Slam? Nope. Ah, no. He didn't move at all. <laughs> like, we're in the ad phase. Like, it, it's so weird. He still has not left this bottom. There we go. Nope, 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 nope. No, nope. nope, let me blink! <laughs> it won't let me blink across, like, this, like, curve thing. It sucks, man. Oh, okay. I think I'm going to save the other ones. I would rather, like, do a practice Maven before jumping into Uber Maven. And Cirrus, I want to quality up and get more Chaos Res before I do those. So, we're going to end this one here. Some tough beats with the Ubers. Got a couple of them down. I got an Ashes of the Stars. That's pretty cool to have. I have the Annihilating Light as well if i wanted to like go triple damage but drop lots of defense that would be rough to throw that in but maybe and while i failed a bunch of them i'm happy that i tried i got more experience with the fights but it's it's not easy not at all even though my build is really min maxed and to the point where it's a possibility to try these things it's it's not easy and it's really punishing on not the most meta builds, even though my build does a ton of damage. But next time, I'm going to start leveling a new build. Probably a wander, mess around with Sacred Wisps, because doing uber bosses and stuff isn't really my forte, honestly. It, what I most enjoy doing in this game is definitely tinkering and playing with new build stuff. And not having access to trade makes things a bit harder to get to that point, but... Like, I've got pretty much everything you could want on this build. I mean, I could have more damage, but honestly, what would more damage really do to help me too much in those fights, right? But with that, I'd like to thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this video, definitely hit the like button as it really helps the channel out a lot. Subscribe to make sure you don't miss more videos from me. If you'd like to help support my channel, please consider using the super thanks, the heart icon just below the video, or by joining to become a member. And I'll see you on the next one. Cheers.